Hi, I'm Angela V. Shelton. And I'm our very best friend, Frances Callier, and we are Frangela. And welcome to another exciting episode of Frangela's Idiot of the Week. Wee, 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 wee. Oh, this is so good. Oh. oh, you've sent it. Thank you for tweeting and Facebooking us at Frangela Duo. Yes, and sending us emails at Frangela.com. We thank you. We thank you. You're so good, Army of Anti Dumb. Let's get started. This first nominee for today is from Corporal Stephen M. You are. Yeah. Um, okay. Man calls police after being sold fake crack cocaine. Yes, this is Homa, Louisiana. After a man called police to inform them that he had been duped into buying $100 worth of fake crack cocaine, he and another man were tossed into jail. Oh, that, that's a, uh, the number of flags on that sentence. I think there are more flags than I words. I know. I know. How many times you cannot call the police for your complaints about drugs? No, no you cannot. Why those lights go off? I don't know. Do we need to move? We're not moving mm-hmm. enough. Yeah, see? <laughs> see? Look, see? <laughs> well, wait. So people have to be in this area, in this room? How do they no, float? No, no, no. No, no, no. It's like it's motion. Is it for Myrtle in yeah, the bathroom? Yeah. Like, what the? Yeah. Moaning Myrtle? All right. Yeah. Whatever. We, nothing but production. Yes. We put all the money that we make off this into production. Yes. Um, so I'll make it clear this is $100 worth of supposed crack cocaine that, in fact, wasn't crack cocaine. It was soap. Bits of soap. Bits of soap. So these two dumbasses, these are the two men. This is their yeah. mugshot. Now, this guy, we're trying to figure out who did what. Right. I do believe that he sold it because he's got that, like, mm, what you want. What you want, yeah. 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 Should, yeah I sold why, the soap. Why I'm in here. Why I'm in here. And he looks it. more like, I really needed that. I really, I really needed, needed that. I trusted you. I really. And I he does. He looks you. hurt. He does look hurt. Doesn't he, looks he look hurt? hurt. Like, he, he looks hurt. to me. Yes. Okay, but their names, they don't make it clear in the picture who is who. So it's like this guy, uh, Parr and Ross. Mr. Yeah. Parr and Mr. Ross. So literally, this is a 50-year-old and a 43-year-old. Yeah. If you don't know at this point in your life mm-hmm. what's crack and what's soap. I know. If you can't tell <laughs> Dove from crack. I, you know what? You shouldn't be smoking It's it. not the habit for you. It's not the habit for you. Because <laughs> this is. If you, you can't sh- tell oregano from weed. If you can't, thank you. I can't. When people fall for that, I one, know, I'm like, are you really? Kidding? I know. Who cubes weed? <laughs> like, who makes little? I know. Who I does know. that? Who puts it in a grinder? But you know what? When 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 we were 16, I had a friend who fell for that once, and it's like, but really? you do that when you're 16 once. But literally, you all. The big problem here. You cannot call the police. And I know no. he's, that, I also think he's mad because he's like, I, he, this dummy, here's, the, what yeah. was supposed to happen was, That's I saw right. you this fake crack. Right. You get upset. Maybe you come looking for me. Maybe you don't. Yeah. Maybe I got to deal with you later. But he, you know, he never thought he'd call, call the, the police. police. I love it. I love it. I love it. I you turn yourself in and me. You it is with that face. It's like, oh, oh, hell no. It is so bad. When you can't count on drug addicts to not call the police, what is happening in our society? What is happening? Idiot! Next up, this is from Private Natty. Natty? Tell us if we're saying it. I think it's Natty. I think it's Natty. Oh. Um, Okay, mom jailed for accidentally feeding baby rum. You know, that old baby rum accident. Apparently, Tressie Piggy. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. I don't understand. Is that the person's name, yeah, actually? Is. Yeah. I keep reading name. it and not believing it. That's yeah. their name. Tressie yeah. Piggy? Yeah. That sounds like a character from a children's book or something. I know. Tressie Piggy went to the market to see her friends, Woogly Boogly and Cat the Meow. Well, those are her friends who were there with her. <laughs> so basically, um, her daughter's name is Leah, right? Yeah. And it's the, her ba- Leah's baby. Leah Piggy mm-hmm. is baby, I guess. Five month old. Apparently, what she did is she says that she mistook um, baby formula. Baby, well, water. water. She had the formula and she was, I guess, powdered formula. And she was yeah. mixing it. You're supposed to mix it with water, and she confused a, a water bottle that she thought was water, but it, it had rum in it, and so that's how the baby got rum in okay. the formula. Okay. 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 Number one, rum smells. Number two. If you can't, if you're mixing stuff with your for your child, your baby, and you are not aware enough, 
or cognizant enough. I'm going to say to tell the difference between water, water and, and anything. Yeah. I mean, water is really yeah. You get water really from like two, three places in your house. <laughs> exactly. You're going to get it from the tap. That's right. Where it doesn't the run. Sink. It doesn't run as rum That's through right. the sink. No, okay? not in my sink. Believe me, I'd still be there. Okay. The, not or the bathroom. Oh, or the bathroom toilet. Right, right, right. So you got to get it from 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 a running source that's not the rum. But if you put water bottles in bottles of water in your fridge that right. aren't sealed. Yeah. Not a pitcher, not a not a Brita. Right. The same out of a Brita. That's what I'm saying. Pitcher. Like, like, right. So we're what we're having trouble with is why you would think anything in the fridge that wasn't a sealed water bottle would be water. Right. That's our first problem. And all, there's a second problem. The first problem is the rum smells light or dark. Yeah. It smells. Right. It's also a little thicker. But yeah. I, you know what? I'm, I'll give you that. I'll give you that one. Not paying attention. Right. But the smell alone. Yeah. I mean, and and also I'm gonna say this too. I don't think this was an accident, even remotely. remotely. Not even remotely. Also, this is my thing. Okay. You you. If you have lived in a house where people are putting bottles that look like water <laughs> of rum, with liquor in with the liquor fridge, then, then you think, you, then you probably know Problem that you solved. should. You should. You should Label. know that maybe you might. You might need to be a, a little pad. more vigilant. A pen, a, a magic marker. Okay. But I think this is a five month old. I'm gonna go with she was crying. That she was crying and she thought she'd give her a little bit of rum because she was teething or some bullshit like that. Yeah. And the baby got alcohol poisoning. Mm-hmm. That's right. Because you know what? Five month olds can't hold their liquor. No, they can't. No five year olds. Or oh, you know what? Good touche. We do have to make this clear. I know. Nobody under the age of twenty one. No. Don't do that. And uh, next up, we already have. We're disagreeing about this one already. This yes. is from private to uh, Brian K. Yeah. Brian, you rock. Uh, Tanya Fowler dials nine one one. She's in Georgia. Over. What? A bad mugshot. Okay, okay. now I run you have you really have to try to get this mugshot. You really have to have to no, have uh, look. to get this mugshot. Okay. Because this Francis and I are disagreeing about this. So this is Tanya. This right. Is Tanya. Right. She contacted Dom One One in reference to being upset about a picture, okay? Her mugshot was it was on an emergent it was on a, a edition of Bad and Busted. I love it. Um which I guess is some kind of is it online or is it like no, it's according to the Barrow County no, is this an online thing? I think it's like a paper, like a paper. I, that's what I'm trying to understand. But in any case, so so she'd been arrested in the past, yeah. right? So this is her uh, old mugshot. Somebody of uh, compiles funny bad mugshots, puts right. it on bad and busted. She sees this, and it's like, as I think, understandably alarmed. I don't think she looks that bad. Okay, Francis, I really don't. Francis, I wonder how old she is. I really do because she could be 87 here. Yeah. Or just that part of her face could be 87. Well, I'm going to tell you something. Her hair, she looks clean. Number well, it's one. black and white. I okay. think you got to see it in the color on. Right. Because it's, it's worse. There's shading issues and discolorations. Really? Okay, but, but you know what? Megas the... can't be choosy when they're getting their, head, their pictures so done. Like, so they told her at 911, look, you can't call 911 because you don't like your old mugshot. This is for emergencies, injuries, or violence. Right. But then she called back again, again and said... Um, that she had another situation, <laughs> not the mugshot, that was an emergency, but right. she's moved on. Right. The new problem was that she needed a place to keep her sleeping bag. Right. Because apparently the residents of a random house. And that's the word that, this is, this is the, the article says, a random house. Wouldn't not let, the publishing company, just no, a random house. A random house wouldn't let her keep her sleeping bags in their home. And you know what? I have so many issues with that. <laughs> I would rather have her sleeping bags than her. <laughs> I mean, take the sleeping bag. Uh, How many sleeping bags does, does Tanya have? I mean, really. She's like, you know, what I love about Tanya is she's like, I am sick and tired of driving around and walking around with these sleeping bags. I need a place to store these. Ding random dong. house. Yeah. Now, why do you think they choose the word random? Because it was random. Like, she does that know. mean she doesn't know anybody That's in right. there? That's not these. Random. Random people. Random. But just so you understand, she called them. Not the people who the random people she asked. She called 911 to say that these people won't let me keep my That's sleeping right. bags in their random ass she house. Was, she was upset about it. I don't know what's going to happen again. Uh, really. I but love you it. need to look at that mugshot because I believe she was right to be that. I don't there. think she should be upset. Oh my God. She looks good. You've been jaded. That is she horrible. Looks good. She got a little Tony Pond. You know what? I, you know what? I'm going to demand that you see it in color. Because <laughs> you don't. 
You don't understand. I'm Angela V. Shelton. I'm our best friend, Francis Callier. We are for Angela. Thank you for watching Idiot of the Week. Yes. Woo!